What's going on, Shady people? Shady Penguin here. Welcome back to the next episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Shady Lock Challenge. Today, we're here in front of Winona, the gym leader of Fortree City, and we're going to take on this gym leader with our team of five and Harper as potential death fodder. Uh, boy, it is warm in here, and it might be the hoodie I'm wearing, but gosh darn it, I'm lowering the AC. I am Winona. I am the leader of the Fortree Pokemon Gym. I don't know why I decided that was going to be your voice, but I did. I have become one with bird Pokemon and have soared the sky. Sky. However grueling the battle, we will triumph with grace. Oh, yeah? Will you, Winona? Witness the elegant choreography of my bird Pokemon and me. I don't think I took our trainee out of the front. Normally we like to put Sniff out there to make sure we get a good start against gym leaders, but I definitely bunked up and did not do that. So we'll see how this battle with Monona goes. Oh, luckily just an Illumise. Fantastic. A little, little non-threatening Illumise. I will take it. Snickers? Snickers? Okay, we're right on par with Snickers, so this is good. Let's go for an Acid Spray and then a Surf. It's like doing two Surfs, but with a little extra damage. Big brain, boys. Big brain. Flatter! That's like the worst case scenario. Actually, it could be worse. It could have been Swagger. Swagger would be worse for me, because my defense is due to butter, uh, and doubling my attack would be a problem. But we're gonna see if we can break through. Come on, come on, Snickers. Snickers! Just one time. Oh, what am I gonna locked into now? Do I get locked into Surf, or do I get locked into Acid Spray? I'm locked into Acid Spray, because it was the last move I successfully used. Oh, fun. You know what? It's okay. Because you have plus two special attack and you have minus two special defense. So we are going to do some serious damage. Oh, you have Zen Headbutt? Uh, That's concerning. Because you also have... Oh, I got the Rocky Helmet. That's right. Okay. So you're definitely going to heal. Um, I'm going to go ahead and swap out to someone that can one-shot you. No one can one-shot you. I'm going to go out into Zekrom. If we still had Ancient Power, we could totally one-shot with, with our Zekrom, but we don't. We got rid of it, unfortunately. Unfortunately, we did. So this is going to be our sixth badge already? Or seventh? Sixth. Fifth? Sixth badge. Wow. Absolute wowzers. Uh, let's go for a Slash here. We should be faster, so we'll get some nice damage off here. Okay. And there's a Flatter. So, this is where we go for the Thunderbolt. We go for the Thunderbolt here because we have plus two now. And if we break through Confusion, it is going to be big, big, big damage. There we go, Illumis. Out of my house immediately, please and thank you. It's a crit! I don't know. Oh, I forgot to turn these lights on. I was wondering why it looked a little different in here. Now I see it. Beep! All right, Winona's going to send out a Toxic Crow. You know what that means. Uh, I would very much love to go out into Snickers here. Uh, I would love to go into Snickers, and I will go into Snickers. Unfortunately, we're not fully healed, or we can just click our move. Uh, but I'm a little afraid of what this Tox Crow can do. Yeah, you better shudder, dude. I got a side strike with your name on it. We're going to go for a Supper Potion here. Let's Supper Potion it up. And a side strike will easily one shot as long as we don't get destroyed by this thing. Sucker Punch. Hey, there we go. Awesome. Cool. Side strike now. Should be fine. The plays doesn't even go for the sucker punch this time. Tried to read my read, and you got red instead. Got him. It's another crit. Oh my gosh, dude. Honestly, crazy. I think I keep my neck like too much, too high like this. Linoon. Is this the new Linoon? Uh, let's go out into. Uh, it stinks. Let's go out into Kesha. Can't really go out into Waffles. Doesn't really work that way. Does not really work that way. We're gonna tilt our head down like this. I think this is gonna be much more comfortable and look way more awkward. Let's see. Okay, Lionu, you're gonna get low kicked. I know you're not that thick, but, ooh, you're bestowing. Thank you, wow. I received your Blockberry. Wow, how kind of you. So kind, much wow. Go for a rogue smash here. Oh, of course you have rest. Why wouldn't you have rest? Well, this is fine. This works out perfectly. You'll be sleeping. I can do a little bit of damage at rogue smash. And uh, we'll be good to go. We'll be good to go. Look at this. Boom! Nice. Is that another crit? It might have been. We're gonna rock smash again. Because you're fast asleep, and I'm gonna wake you up with this death punch. 
Just punching, smashing rocks. So level 40, after skipping a ton of trainers, we're basically on par for the most part against this team. Leafeon. We do have a problem against grass types, honestly. And I didn't evolve, I didn't evolve Kesha again. Oh, I promise you guys, I promise you guys, in tomorrow's episode, Kesha will be evolved for sure. For sure. Uh, let's see, Leafeon, Leafeon. You know, let's go to the Zekrom. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's give Zekrom a little bit extra love today. I think that's fair. I think that's extremely fair. Uh, Terra Volt is activating. Leafeon is pretty bulky on the physical side. I'm just gonna go for a Dragon Breath here. Giga Drain, this should not do much. Yeah, 10 damage, nice. Nice, Leafeon's special attack is not his forte at all. Uh, can we get the para? No para. Go for another one though. Sunny day. This is gonna be a heckin' fast Leafeon if he has chlorophyll. A heckin' fast Leafeon. Paralyzed, 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 paralyzed. Nope! Well, he's already faster than me anyway. He's got four legs, I got two. And it's sunny day synthesis. Oh my word. Oh my word. I'm sad. We need the para now. Come on, we need a paralysis. We need a paralysis on this. Um, never mind. He's synthesizing again. Why would you synthesize so much? Are you an alchemist? Come on now. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Come on, bro. Come on, bro. This is the power right here. This is the para. Oh no. All right, this isn't gonna work. This is just gonna be pee pee exhaustion. Uh, we can go to the sniff and incinerate in the sun. I guess we'll do that. We'll go out to sniff and incinerate in the sun. I guarantee you the sun's running out this turn though. I will, I will bet money. You will bab my bottom dollar that the sun is running out. Question of the day, what is your favorite weather to use in Pokemon? For me, it's definitely rain. I love rain teams. Uh, I don't know, something about Swift Swim. There's a lot of water types that I really like. I told you the sun is going away. Well, let me know your favorite weather to build a team around, if you do that at all. If you don't, then choose one. What would be your favorite weather team to build around? For me, it is rain. I love the rain. I would. Lo I love Seattle. There are things that I love that are that are in Seattle, and it rains a lot there. And I just, I love Swift Swim. I love, I don't know. There's just so much. I love the fact that you can throw thunder onto it. Like, it has another typing it affects. Kind of like how sun also affects grass types that you, or any type that uses sunny day, but a lot of grass types have chlorophyll. So sun teams will often be like very fire and grassy, and then uh, rain teams will be like, throw some electric in there along with the water. I don't know. And then of course, like steel types go on rain teams because you're reducing their fire weakness. So can grass types as well, but steel types are usually better. Or a grass steel type like a ferrothorn. Usually works really well on a rain team. It's another crit. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Come on. Come on, Sniff grows to level 47. Beautiful. Zekrom gains 1458 and Fortress is gonna come out. We're gonna stay in only because we have the sun on our side. This thing gets explosion. Uh, Sniff just counters everything this thing wants to do. For certain. For certain. It has the sturdy, of course. Goes for pay. Oh, I thought it was based. I thought it was like based on the damage, like mirror, like mirror move. Uh, nope. Uh, counter, like counter, and it is mirror move. That is a move, right? Yeah, I'm not making that up. Cool, sweet, awesome, fantastic. Winona is gonna send out a Carbink as the final Pokemon. Waffles, get out here! You don't have a Steel type move, but you do have a Ground type move, and I'll take it. It's as good as it's gonna get. I mean, I think a Water type move from Pentacruel would be stronger. But you know what? You didn't really get a chance to shine today, Waffles. So what's great now is that we'll be able to use Fly. Hopefully I have a Pokemon in my box that can learn Fly, because I don't think I have one on the team. And we can go ahead and go get, we can do a ton of things today with Fly. We can do an absolute monstrous amount of things. And by that, I mean like two things, maybe three. I think we can do three things. Okay, it's two at KO, perfect. We cannot escape, the guard has been split. I think you just made yourself weaker on the defense, honestly. I'm pretty sure. 
I'm pretty positive you did. Here we go. Goodbye, Car Rink. And we get through our sixth gym without a single loss, which I don't think has happened in a while. I think we've lost Pokemon in almost every single gym. I could be wrong. I think there was one other gym that we got through Scott Free. Never before have I seen a trainer command with Mag Boy. Oh. That's all I'm hearing. That's all I'm hearing. No! I don't want to read your text. Instead, I just want to take your badge and I want to take that shady token, put it in my pocket. We now have, well, we should have six shady tokens, shouldn't we? We should definitely have six shady tokens. I think it's also cool that it happened to work out. We got a team for Inferno. Uh, it also worked out that the flying gym leader gives you the ability to use fly outside of battle. I think that's actually really cool. It doesn't always happen, obviously, because there's not always a flying type gym, but I think that's actually pretty nifty. Let's see before I forget who can learn Inferno. Zekrom can. With a 50% accuracy, I'm gonna go ahead and say pass. I'm gonna go ahead and say pass. Because, no, no, I'm not, I'm not really one to mess with accuracy moves that are that low. Not really my style, I have to admit. I really have to figure out what's wrong with my neck before it gets any worse. I definitely do. I'll have to, I'll actually, I'll have to go to the chiropractor on Monday. I'll have to make it a point. Because it is not getting worse, but it's definitely not getting better, no matter what I do. Okay, anyone on our PC can use fly. Yes! We have a shiny Amolga that I think I can fly on. We also have a Spiro if we can't fly on the shiny Amolga. But Milo, if we can fly on you, you will be our, uh, our fly baby today. And you'll be the reason why we get a ton of important things. Like I said, by a ton, I mean like two. Let's see. Oh, ooh, Zekrom can learn fly? Why can't I fly on a little tiny electric rat? I don't understand. Where's, where's, the, where's the logical fallacy in that? I'm so confused as to why that does not work. So very confused. Oh well, we're gonna go ahead and go with Spiro then. I'm not gonna teach fly to Zekrom, that's just crazy. That's just crazy. And I'm not gonna do any battles with Spiro. He's not actually on the team. He's just gonna be a fly baby for us, for now. Uh, Cause we need to do, ooh, I just remembered something else we need to do. Just by looking at my Pokemon's HP, I remembered exactly what I need to do. Isaac, fly me around, please. Be my taxi. I'm begging for you to be my taxi. Let's go ahead and forget Growl. We learned fly! Wow! Good job! Ah! See, every time I do that, my neck hurts. Ah! Okay, maybe we shouldn't do that. Oh well. Okay, let's fly. So first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go back to Little Rooch. And we're gonna grab the amulet coin from mom so we can really rake in them big bucks and pay off her mortgage for her. Because Norman's always at the gym. He's losing battles. He lost to me and he lost all that money. Basically a mortgage payment. So mom is stuck carrying the load. Let's see. Oh, did dad give you that badge? Then here's something from your mom. Amulet coin, huzzah. It's a wonderful thing to try hard at your passion. But don't push yourself too hard, dear. You can always come home if you need to. Good luck, honey. She's saying that you don't have to have perseverance. You could just abandon your dream whenever you feel like it. Cool, thanks, mom. Let's go ahead and give this to, give this to Kesha. We'll make it a point to use Kesha for a little while. I like the Rocky Helmet on Tentacruel. Okay, next stop. It's not like we'll need Fly forever, because we'll obviously we'll get Latios soon. I think, anyway, or Latios, one of the two. Okay, next place we want to go. We want to go to... Rossboro City. Because we have a little fossil that we can make come to life. And I don't know if I need room in my PC, in my party for it. I don't think I do, actually, for the fossil. I think they are, they are technologically savvy enough to auto-transfer it to my box. We'll find out in just a little bit, won't we? Go to the second floor. Look, and you can even see, look, they have fossils, uh, fossil Pokemon on the back behind the, red, the register lady, or behind the receptionist, that's the correct word, to let you know they do this. Um, and we totally didn't notice that. So let's see, second floor. Do you do it? Because you're behind a desk. I am researching Pokemon fossils here. You have a fossil, don't you? Shall I restore it for you? Okay then, I'll turn that claw fossil back into a Pokemon for you. 
Oh, I gotta get my phone. Do we get to nickname this thing? I restore the fossil you gave me, turning it back into a Pokemon. This is Anorith. Please take good care of it. But it's actually an Oon Pheasant. It's a flying type. Uh, we can't nickname it. That's a shame. Well, Oon Pheasant is in the box. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna use it. We do get an encounter today, I believe. So I'm not gonna rush to use that Pokemon. Can we surf outside? Yeah, we could surf outside of battle. There's like, we, there's a ton of stuff we can do. Now I'm thinking about it. Uh, okay, so something else I wanted to do, uh, not as super impactful or important as those things, I guess, but I want to, who sells the milk? You sell the milk? I think the milk is sold here. We need to buy a ton of milk. And when I say a ton, I literally mean 2,000. Bottles! No, I'm not gonna buy 2,000 bottles. I'm not gonna do that. Okay, so let's see. You are the mil moon milk seller. Yes, I'll take a dozen. I will take three dozen milks. Three dozen milks will be my delight. Yes, please. Thank you. I'm just gonna stretch my neck a little bit. A little bit of a stretch. I'll take a dozen. Thank you. My Moo Moo Milk. We've done it. Huzzah. Okay. So. Now. Let me see something. Let me see. Okay. We have three dozen Moo Moo Milk. Let's heal up our team. Let's use our super potions first, obviously, because they are worse to use in battle. They restore a lot less HP than our milks. Okay, we could fly. We could fly, we could fly, we could fly. We could surf, we could fly, we could surf, we could fly. Where else do we want to go is the question. I'm gonna go ahead and put, uh, before I forget, I'm gonna put Kesha out front. Kesha is holding that amulet coin. And until we get a new Pokemon to train, she will continue to hold that money and get that sh money. Okay, we could technically fly to, hmm. We could fly here to Slateport and start sailing over here or surfing, but I don't think that's the right way to go about it. We could also go to 109, which we've already caught a Pokemon here, but we could go to Route 108, which we've never caught anything. And there's Sea Mauville there. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, what happens if we go to Mauville? Isn't there supposed to be some sort of event when you go to Mauville that like, oh, they ask you to go to Sea Mauville, or will that happen later on in the game? I feel like that might happen later on in the game. Let's just see if we see the gym leader. Uh, chilling out here. No, we don't see the gym leader chilling out here. Let's just check in front of his uh, gym real quick. And if he's not out there, then I'm just misremembering and we're not going to worry about Seamawville for now. Yeah, he's not out here. Okay, can I fly while I'm in here? That's a good question. I feel like I can. Yep. Did not think so. Okay, so let's go back to the courtyard. Yard of courts, where we can go ahead and do the thing. What is this other little area on the map that I've never been to? This little green dot. You see that? Oh, it's just part of the map underneath. Never mind. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Let's go and fly. I guess let's just try to get this new encounter today. You know? We can go from 120 down to 121, which we've never been to. Uh, there's also the safari zone here. Ooh, so we can get two new encounters today. Nice. Ooh, I gotta pull up nicknames for sure then. I gotta pull up nicknames for certain. Let's see. Uh, let's get on our bike. Just kidding, we're gonna have to get off our bike immediately. So that's fun. That's a good time. Run down the stairs. Those are not stairs, that's a ladder. Why can't I drop from the ladder like in every other video game? Because Pokemon's realistic. Every other video game. I'm not worried about these berries up here. I don't have a cut user right now. I don't believe I do. No! Curses and salutations! We could have had a Scorpy! I mean, that was one of the Pokemon in our horde encounter anyway, but it would have been 12 levels weaker. I couldn't get away. Interesting, Scorpy. I'm gonna try again. I still can't get away. Interesting, Scorpy. Ah, Acupressure. One of my favorite non-damaging moves, if not my favorite. All right, we're just gonna kill you then. All right. 
You're really not gonna let me run? And you're gonna crit me instead? Cool. You're not seeing the light of day. You're just not seeing the light of day, that's it. Okay, that does nothing, wow. Fine, I'll throw some rocks at you, how about that? Did you get a defense buff? Is that what happened? Special defense raises sharply. Goodbye, score to pie. Got him. Absolutely positively got him. Run dun 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 run dun 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 dun. Ooh, a battle! My Pokemon is strong, how about your Pokemon? Listen, man, we're trying to catch some new Pokemon today. Didn't really want to battle you like this. Wasn't really the intention. Seismitoad is hitting the board. I can low kick you. You are a big old set of bubble wrap. You are a big old, big old blob of bubble wrap, and I could definitely low kick you. Rain dance! One of my favorite weathers. Well, my favorite weather to battle with, for sure. Wow, that does so much less damage than I had thought. I really want a grass type move, man. I really do. I think I'm gonna stay in regardless. I'm just gonna low kick again. Moody water. How much will this do? Oh! My gosh! Why is that so much damage? Oh my goodness, dude. Like, it's not that serious. It's definitely a little serious, but it's not that serious. What? Oh, I just need that to crack. I guarantee you if that just cracks right there. I'll feel so much better. We dodged that muddy water, thank the Lord. I'm gonna dragon breath here. Muddy water, at least it's resisted, so it won't do as much. Yeah, buddy. We tanked that pretty well. And deep breath is not enough, sadly. I'm gonna slash him then. Out of mostly frustration. That's how I sound when I'm frustrated. When Sarah's like, honey, to get the garbage, I go. That's a peek into our marriage. Have fun with that. Kesha grows to level 41. Wants to learn the move, scary face. I'm sorry, Kesha, your face is not scary. It's beautiful. You are a beautiful little girder. Are you a girder? Yeah, timber girder. I did it. And you're gonna give me a Choppleberry. Why can't you just give me a Master Ball? I don't really understand what your problem is. A Master Ball would be a fine gift to give someone after they beat you in a battle. It's pretty fair, not over the top. You won't make anyone feel awkward with it. So don't worry about it. We're just gonna use all of our super potions and fully heal. This is why Moomoo's are gonna be the life-saving part of our LP for sure. Moomoo's will keep our money up. Uh, we're probably gonna have to face these trainers pretty well. Uh, because, ooh, because they are getting really strong and we're gonna need to keep our team on par. So we're not gonna be able to skip many of these trainers. I'm mainly trying to dodge them for now so we can go ahead and, ooh, this is a problem Pokemon for me. We can go ahead and um, grab these two new Pokemon potentially first and then use the experience on the new Pokemon, etc., etc. I'm gonna low kick, hopefully you don't have sturdy. Okay, it doesn't even one shot regardless. Goes for the Bulldoze, which is gonna lower my speed. I'm not sure if it'll make me slow enough to lose. I'm hoping it doesn't. I'm gonna smash rocks literally. Yes, and we're still faster. Beautiful. Otherwise, an explosive self-destruct would have killed Kesha. Kesha would have been gone. And that would have been extremely, extremely bad. Pokemon Breeder Angelica has been defeated. Huzzah. Huzzah, I dare say, and though. Yes. Huzzah and though. Okay. Uh, I don't know which direction. I guess I'm supposed to go south. It looks like south is the right way. We're still on Route 120. What's up here? Oh, okay. I'm fine with that. So, Route 120. Can we get to 121? Show me, show me 121. Here we go! We did skip a ton of trainers, like I said, because I want to get this new encounter on Route 121, which is right here, and our encounter is going to be... I have a shiny Wurmple. We're calling, we're calling species. We are calling species right now. Sorry, my dude. You are not who I wish to capture today. Not today, probably not ever. Uh, I'd like to make it to a place that I can fly to. You fly to the Safari Zone. Oh, that's a great Pokemon! Lamp Bent? Please and thank you, level 29. All right, here's what we're hitting you with. We're hitting you with that acid spray. Oh, I would love to catch a Lamp Bent. 
Lampent. I'm, I'm probably pronouncing it in such a way that's going to tilt you, but... I would... L I love Chandelure, man. Oh, Chandelure is such a good Pokemon. Such a good Pokemon. For realsies. Uh, let's go ahead and... Yeah, let's Acid Spray. Can't really do much else. You should resist this. Calculations are correct. Here we go. This is fine. This is fine. We're going to go for another Acid Spray. And then... Okay, that's all we can do. That's it. Can't do anything else. Imprison me. Imprison me quietly. We're going to go for uh, an Ultra Ball here. Here we go. I think we'll catch it. I think we'll catch it. I don't know. I, th I feel like... Lampent evolves, like, very high. I'm not positive, but I feel like it's a pretty high evolution. Oh, it has Willow! Oh, it's gonna be so useful for our team. Even though we have Dust Noir, this is a fire type. This is a type that I really want on the team. The only other type I'm really desperate to add is Grass. Grass and Fire were the two types I was really missing, but I wanted to get Stab of on the team, and now we can have it. But we can have, we can have at least one. <sighs> I really hope so, anyway. Because this is starting to look problematic. It's definitely starting to look problematic. We have five Ultra Balls left. After this throw. Oh yeah, we're just going to catch it on this one then. That's why. That's all. We'll just catch it right here. That's a critical capture. Come on. One. Two. Three. It's not a crit, but it is a capture! Woo! Ah, oh, what a good Pokemon to catch. My goodness. Uh, let's look for a nickname here for a male lamp bent. Which will end up being... Will end up being a hopefully a chandelure. Let's see. Hmm. Ooh, you know what? I, I like this. Uh I kind of like the nickname Bishop. I like the nickname Bishop, which was suggested by why oh, don't the comment just go away? What the hashtag? Where'd it go? Oh my gosh. I'm going to nickname you Bishop because I know it was suggested. I just can't find the comment to thank the person. Okay. Bishop. Okay. It was suggested by Brendan Barnes. Brendan, thank you so much for supporting the series. I leave in a comment and leave in a like. I appreciate it so much. Glad you're enjoying it enough to stay involved. Uh, I'm really quick. Oh, I was going to try to get the Safari Zone. Okay. We're moving out to Mount Pyre. We're getting our hands on that ore before Team Magma dies. All right. So that's like our hints to be like, hey. Would you like to head to Mount Fire? Oh, in order to get to the Safari Zone, I need to battle these two ladies. Oh! It's me scared. Okay, here we go. We're gonna try to make short work of them then. We're gonna have our two big boys out front. When we're not, when we're together, nothing scares us. We'll show you how great we are. When we're together, nothing scares us. Okay, we're gonna say the same thing twice, I guess. That's fair. We're gonna see, we're gonna see. I am running out of time today though. Ooh, Gothitelle and Donphin. Gothitelle and Donphin. Well, this is fine. Imagine if the name was actually Donphin. I love it. Kind of sounds like it could be. We're going to low kick the Donphin, and we are going to shadow punch the Gothitelle. Um, we have to end this battle next turn. For sure. I didn't think a Shadow Sneak would actually knock you out. Yeah, Shadow Sneak definitely would not have knocked you out. Oh, wow. Future Sight's going to do so much damage if we don't end this battle. Okay, let's do this. Let's do another low kick. And then let's shadow sneak on the Gothitelle. So get Geth Goth out of there before she can do like a psychic type move besides Future Sight on my Kesha. Because we are not losing Kesha when Kesha is evolving next episode. 100%. 100%. It's already level 42. We're getting money for this battle, by the way. We're getting money. Magnitude 8 is going to connect on both Pokemon here. Uh, not do a crazy amount because that's spread damage, thankfully. Uh, and then we should be able to end the battle right here, no problem. Uh, I'm going to low kick, and I'm going to shadow sneak. Actually, we can shadow punch. We're, we're faster. No reason to shadow sneak. Oh, I lied. If we would have lost Kesha because of that, I was going to cry. Why all of a sudden is my Dawn Van so slow before it shadow punched Gothitelle like turn two? That was really weird. That was very strange to me. Very, very, very strange to me. Okay, let's go ahead and scout out this. I think this is the Safari Zone. I'm pretty positive. Hello and welcome to the Safari Zone. Admittance is free. Catch all the Pokemon you can. Enjoy yourself with your Pokemon as long as time allows. Do I not get special balls? Hello, hello and welcome. I hope you meet lots of Pokemon. I guess I don't get special Pokeballs. Really? I'm so confused. 
Uh, I don't understand that, but sure. Let's go ahead. Let's put Zekrom out front. Zekrom has a variety of moves, at least. I don't know if we're going to be damaging. I don't know how this works. I'm so confused. Let's see. Our Safari Zone encounter is going to be. It is a Raichu. That is going to be difficult to catch. That is definitely going to be difficult to catch. Luckily, I can go for a Thunderbolt here, I think. I don't think you have Lightning Rod. Uh, go for a Thunderbolt. And, ooh, bring it down to yellow. That's cool. His Thunderbolt's going to do nothing to me, or her Thunderbolt. And this is going to be a tough one to catch, guys. Raichu. Raichu, really? One? Yeah. I didn't think we'd catch it on the first ball. That would have been insane. Thunder Shock. Did you just Thunderbolt and then Thunder Shock? I think you did. It's a crit. We'll try one more ball. Uh, but if not, I think I have to go for my Steel type move since it's resisted and not stab. It should hopefully not knock you out. One, two, three. Hey, I did not expect to catch that. Okay. Uh, Raichu is our next catch. Female Raichu. I don't know if this is supposed to be a male, a female name, but I like the name and I want it to be part of our LP. So Casey suggested Webby. So we're going to go ahead and name you Webby. Webby our Waichu. Webby the Waichu. Thank you so much, uh, Casey, for supporting the series by leaving a comment and a like on the video. I appreciate it so much. Webby has joined the LP in the box, though, because we do have a Zekrom. Uh, but I do think we're going to go ahead and try to snag our Lampent. Wow, Safari Zone is weird in this game. Uh, I think I'm going to try to grab my Lampent from the box. <sighs> Are you kidding me? That's such a spit in the face. We haven't seen a shiny in so long. And then we just see... <sighs> oh my goodness, that's insane. Well... I'm gonna go ahead and wrap this one up here on that salty note. If you made it this far, do hashtag not my shiny in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to show some shady love to that thumbs up down below. Luckily, we can access the box right here so we can grab our lamp pent and add it to the squad, replace our Spiro, and we can do the most. It has flame body, and it's careful, so it's pretty good. With that, like I said, I'm gonna get the hashtag out of here. Have yourselves a fantastic day, but above all else, keep it shady.